Hi everyone, welcome you all. So previously we have seen sample paper which was issued by CBSE in 2020-21, that is current year, right? And today we are going to discuss sample paper issued by CBSE previous year or in 1920, right? This is question number three, which is from the same unit, though the pattern is different at uh, this time. Um, you can see previously we have a complete question of network in concept which comprises of you can check out the marks 1 2 3 4 4 plus 2 is equals to 6 6 plus 5 is equals to 11 11 plus 4 is equals to so 15 marks so 15 mark question, 15 mark question from a, a networking and a networking concept you can say that right so let us Go through this one by one. So DAS is an example of a public cloud. So I told you what is a cloud. So cloud is a uh, um, uh, what we can say that a cloud. Cloud is a services uh, or internet based services you can utilize by uh, giving them rent instead of completely purchasing them. For example, if you need a storage space and you don't want to buy a pen drive or you don't want to um, buy a hard drive because you want it for a limited period of time then in this scenario you can uh, buy a public storage for from a google drive or one drive or uh, any from anywhere any uh, any storage hosting uh, company so here what is a public cloud so public cloud is available for public Okay, and some portion of it is obviously free. For example, if you use a Google Drive, so it is a public drive and it is free for up to 15 GB. And if you want to store more, then you have to pay for that, right? So here, OneDrive or Google Drive is the perfect example. Any of the uh, public cloud name will give you one marks, right? Now, students, understand this why i told you the definition of a cloud because when we are doing revision we should not stick to the answer answer of a particular question we should be looking uh, to co uh, cover the maximum we can cover from this um, question so here is a term called cloud so first of all definition for the cloud you have to write down and then you should be understanding what is public cloud and then we have to write the example of a public cloud and private cloud and the cloud obviously which is uh, meant for a, a particular company right for example oracle oracle gives you a um, means private cloud it is available for only people who are in the company uh, they can only use it or it, you have to pay a very heavy fee if you want to do it i uh, use that space now the next is dash is a network of a physical objects embedded with electronics surface sensor and network connectivity okay so then what is it dash is a network of physical objects embedded with electronics software sensor and network connectivity i think it's internet so basically internet is a collection of it is a network of computers to share the information right so not only hardware is involved actually softwares and sensors are also involved so the correct answer for this is uh, internet okay and the next is this is a device that forwards data packets along network any guesses i think it's a router so router is the device which sends the packets to or along the network right so it is a intelligent device next is dash describe the maximum data transfer rate of a network or internet connection guess what i am talking about communication channel so here uh, um, it should be optical fiber cable right so which can carry maximum amount of data 
I was oh, okay it is now it is talking about uh, internet connection so internet connection is a broadband connection which gives you a, a higher speed okay maximum is i think in this in the satellite so I'm the next is give the full form of the following i think it is easy http hypertext transmission protocol file transfer protocol and uh, VOIP is voice over internet protocol SSH is secure cell okay so secure cell is a public key cryptography to authenticate the remote computer and, and allow it to authenticate the user right so it is a uh, identification mechanism uh, by the use of encryption so that a remote computer can be identified over a network i think voice over internet protocol is used to um, send a voice messages right file transfer mainly for transferring meeting up big files or simply transfer of uh, file from one computer to another using a ftp http is generally used when we want to transmit a hypertext or uh, HTML file you can say that okay now coming to the F how many pair of wires are there in twisted pair cable what is the name of port comma which is used to connect Ethernet cable to a computer or laptop so obviously twisted pair so you have two pairs of wire okay one pair in each bundle you can say and uh, you need a ethernet port to communicate uh, ethernet in ethernet uh, port we can insert a rj45 connector so uh, sometimes instead of asking port it can ask a connector type so in that scenario you have to answer a rj45 so two questions can be made from here okay now Identify the type of cyber crime for the following situation. A person complains that rupees 4.25 lakh have been fraudulently stolen from his her account online via some online transaction in two days using a net banking. So this type of fraud is called banking fraud. Okay. The, now the next is a person complains that his her debit card or credit card is safe with him still somebody has done shopping or like ATM transaction on this card so this is called the identity theft okay now the next is a person complains that somebody has created a fake profile on a Facebook and defaming his her character and abusing abusive comments and picture so this is called cyber stalking okay i think this is clear so one question from the identity theft or you can say uh, internet or cyber crimes will be asked and the next is a question which is a four marks i think i have taught you this previously also so let us um, I think I have taught you this let us simply go through this suggest the most suitable place to host the server of the company with the suitable reason I think you can do it it is a block C okay mm, I think you can do it right so I'm leaving up to you how you do it right if you have any problem you can ask in live class or you can simply whatsapp me your questions I will definitely try to answer okay so see you next day till the time bye bye and have a nice day